Hello everybody, today we are installing the complete 360 airflow, increased durability, ultra quiet and low power draw Sirocco 2 fan. Wow. This is the ultimate van life RV fan. Why is Lion wearing a helmet? Because he was skating earlier, but now I think it's the safest thing. He might live in a helmet. Why does he have a screwdriver? Are you working right now in the van? Oh, you learned your lesson. You fell out of this thing once before, yeah. huh? What's in the box, Ba? Thank you, Ryan. Thanks, buddy. Okay, it comes with a manual. Quick connects. But this goes into a 110, which I'm not going to use that part of it. But. And then here is the old fan. So it's actually really big. Like when I saw this on YouTube. Oh, it's pretty whatever, good for Lion to put his whole hand in there. Just cut it off. We'll call him Nubby from now so. on. He'll have like a mitten for hands. It's silicone, so it's actually pretty safe, I think. So the cool thing about this is that you'll be able to fold it up. So it can, thank you, Lion. If this is your roof, it can be pretty flat against the roof. So it is very big. How's that going over there, Lion's good? It's very big, but you can tuck it out of the way. Hi guys, so- You aren't made long enough to get us both in there. It is, look. <laughs> oh wait, I'm carrying the camera, hang up. There, there we go, there we go, there we go, there we are. We almost installed the 360 fan and then realized we didn't film any of it. So we figured that we should show you, Highline, how to install this fan. I really need a coffee because- Show them how to install it, just show them we're installing the fan. I'm showing you we're installing the fan, that's all. So this right here is the base plate and the base plate has six mounting points and this has six holes. Imagine that! It connects to those holes. Somewhere, there we go. And then you just let it hang. And then it just hangs. And then we managed to have a little bit of a space here where we're gonna finesse the wire through. We finesse through this hole that's already there in the fan. And we're gonna run it along the back of the cabinet. Kind of keep it real stealth and low. And then into the control center. It's gonna run along there, drop down to that little box over there. But for now, we're just kind of assessing the height. Are we good with this right here? I think that's fine. So we just hooked up the wires to the fan. It's really annoying because these parts are like really small. And, and I know this needle nose pliers isn't the best thing for this, but I don't want to go look for something that fits. And it doesn't actually indicate which is positive and which is negative. So we're going to have to decide on that over here. So it's really simple. You tuck the wire down this little wire canal you center the six mounting points again wherever they are and then you just drop it into place and then right here has two bolts on either side to fasten it so this thing doesn't vibrate out we're gonna carve out a little canal in our cement and then sink the wire into the cement and then re-cement that area so the fan's pretty amazing it has three speeds you turn it on to one speed and then it goes faster and faster speed. You can move it to anywhere you want in the space. It's a good old breeze. The route is being calculated. Now turn left. Okay, we're gonna go pick up our window. This is like... Oh, Lion's gonna pick it up. <laughs> oh my god, look at him, oh my gosh. Lion, little, little thing. Can you adjust his head? Yeah, hold on, let me give you his <laughs> So I believe I have to go to the customer service to pick up, but it's been like a complete nightmare, the whole process of getting this window so I'm hoping that everything runs smoothly right now. Just in time. I'm coming to pick up A3806. A3806, yeah. Alright, not without an extra fight at the end, but we got the window. We can get it, yeah. We can pick it up. Give him the receipt. Yeah. You good? Thank you. You need my help, right? Perfect. So sturdy. I 
hope to never deal with these people again. Babe. No, it was so bad. What if we break a window? We'll, we'll have to buy a window by a different company that hopefully <laughs> fits the same size. It was so bad. It has been two months. Like I. Mm. So obviously you weren't talking to the guy that you were talking to on the no, phone. No, because that guy's in an office. So basically. So he's gonna get the good review. Yeah, I don't know. I can't explain Everybody the whole thing now. I hope you guys have had better experiences with Sierra Lions because they've been an absolute nightmare for from the beginning and every single person except Pedro Sanchez is completely incompetent. Can french fries fix it? French fries can always fix it. Hey, 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 what's going on over here? Are you are you vlogging this? No, I'm not vlogging it. You're just going to put in a window without telling anyone? I don't know. It's just like I got Lion, I got a podcast. Okay. Oh my gosh. I, I'm like trying to play like sun hockey. Like I'm like the goalie here. <laughs> you gotta do it for the vlog, Felix. Okay, so you gotta come vlog. No, I'm editing. Okay, well you gotta come, you know what I mean? You gotta come film the know what I mean. Did he poop again? I just changed his diaper. Your nostrils off the hook. I just changed his diaper. So I guess you get the hint what you gotta do here, right? Yeah. Papo, what are you doing over there, buddy? You working? Man, I hope that doesn't hit your toe. That doesn't look dangerous at all, huh? Oh, wow. Wow. It's going down right now. Hey, it's a one way. All right, so he's parked backwards on a one way street because this is the things that you need to do so we can have the van on the street side. You gotta do what you gotta do. Working curbside downtown LA. I apologize, Metro bus there. Come close. We got the little dots. Easiest way to kind of cut out your window. You just bang out the dots from the inside out. Then I let my beautiful wife with her little pattern making skill set and her little tools from Fitum, which is actually right there behind that yellow building. Make these little arm loops and inseam curves and Okay, so I guess it's my time to shine. Hopefully no cops stop us or anything. But I'm just going to do what Felix said and do the cut out of that window. I wear these solar shield glasses that I took from my mother-in-law when I have to look at bright light because look at that. Like the way that it's so oversaturated, I can't look directly at it. Hi, buddy. Hi, cutie. It looks pretty good. It doesn't have to be perfectly neat. You just need to be able to have a proper guide so that you can cut out. It's pretty good to go. So now it's like Felix's turn just to cut out the actual window. Mine's got a sippy. Hanging out. It's time to get this right. You ready? How you like those solar shields? Oh, they're great. My mom's like walking around Miami blind right now. Baby girl, you're so fine. I can get you off my mind. Ooh, girl. Remember when you didn't want to work at night? Yes. This is why. Yeah. Because it's too hot. Wow. But okay, you want me to tan my head? This is why. It's like 100 degrees today. At least you can and see yes, better. Yes, 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 yes. I know I could use a jigsaw. I'm choosing not to. We at? Where we at? Where we at? Back to corners. I switched to a jigsaw because it's just struggle life out here. But I mean, it's making a much more jagged edge. You get it? Jagged edge? Jagged edge. Girl, we should get married. I think that's 112. Oh, yeah. I don't know. <laughs> anyway, um, don't judge me on my R&B, but judge me on my dance moves. Ooh. Now, um, yeah, we're cutting these two corners. We're going to sand a little extra or whatever. We're getting this window in. And the blue tape is so the body of the van doesn't get scratched. The inside doesn't matter. The foot's only this wide, as you see. Cutting area is uh, protected. Listen, 
Don't we need gloves? How are you gonna hold the edges of that thing? That beam right there seems very sturdy. Why don't you put gloves on? Missing something? I, I guess uh, I didn't go deep enough on those cross beams right oh, there. Oh, I see them right here. But those cross beams weren't on this side too? They were. I could have sworn they were. They were, you just didn't go deep enough. Okay, so let's get those. Okay. So he just went again, but it doesn't seem like those two beams are cutting, so I suggested to use the jigsaw, we'll see. You're insane. You're completely insane. I'm not even going to move this anymore. The girl is just about to go down the van. We gotta get the back. No, no, yeah. Estos amamos demás. Enamorado de tu mirada. Y tu de otra. Por que eres así. Ya sé. Good job, babe. No sientes lo mismo. Jigsaw was tugging the outside of the van occasionally and it makes like little dents and yes some of it gets hidden inside the rubber but also those little dents could cause a bump in the rubber that could cause like a leak and I'd rather just slither it away and then just file it away. That's the dent that Jake's on made. Yeah. yeah. All right, so the window is cut out finally. It wasn't as easy, I feel like. Huh. No. 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 We're gonna unbox the window no. and then get it in, right? Yeah. He agrees. We've just opened the box for the window and Felix can attest to the fact that when we were on the phone with these people asking if they'd given us the wrong window, they said, CR Lauren said verbatim, my manager says they do not make the CR Lawrence T-Vent windows for 170 extenders with the double flap. However, I don't know. This looks like it's a double flap. So they had to have given us the wrong window. First try, right? First, I don't know how to lie. <laughs> what are you doing right now? I'm filing the little metal shrapnel bits and then we're gonna paint. It's kind of hard though because there's like all this inside that you also want to get to. And it's a lot of dirt. It's a lot of dirt. Even though we taped it up, it still gets really messy. So I don't know what a better solution is, but this is what we did. Got a nice window. What do you think about your window, Pop? Are you happy you're getting a window? You're not happy you're getting a window? What happened to your shoe? You threw it away, you got a dirty diaper, you drop your milk. You're a mess, Pop. Baby, you didn't have a bigger brush? <laughs> You're the one who gave it to me. No, I didn't. You went to Home Depot and you bought that massive brush just for this job. Just for this, yes. That's what okay, I so what are you doing? Can you see the name of this paint here? Yes. So I'm just covering all the exposed metal with paint. And basically it's just rust treatment uh, to avoid and prevent any rust. From happening so any exposed metal would rust over time so we're just going to paint that and then we have to leave it a few hours to dry 
Some people leave it overnight, but I don't think they're that ambitious. Lion, what, what's happening over there? My man's out here with a safe head, but he got like toxic toes. Where's my your shoe? Foot, we're gonna have to amputate that left foot at a year and five months. On the streets of downtown, this is disgusting. All right, window install. Felix is drilling. You can see how pulled in it is on this end versus this end seems like it's far out. Right there, when the drill pulls everything in, that um, rubber thing will push against the van. See? Well, today definitely feels like the biggest labor of love because this window, which we thought with experience would be easier, turned out to be a challenge. But we've almost got it in. We had to take it out one more time, file down or grind and then file down that section over there. I think the funny or more frustrating thing about this is that when the window goes on, it, it doesn't really feel like it's in because there's like a big space and it, it has to pull in like, how much would you say, like half an inch? It's like we kept thinking, oh no, it's not all the way in yet. Well, as you drill, the screws pull everything in. So much brighter in here. Open. Any last words, sir? Well, that sucked, <laughs> but at least line had a window. So what do you think of the window? Your first few moments with your window. Do you like it? Better like it. it. Took us a whole day. What do you take? You're really dirty. Look at your feet. Your feet are like, yeah, those feet. So yay! We got window. Mwah. Mwah. Thank you for the window. Give me a kiss if you like the window. Mwah. Thank you.